Quick Lightroom to Photoshop Stereoscopic GIF Tutorial. I'm flipping through my pictures here and I notice this one actually does a pretty good job. So I'm bouncing back and forth and I like that. I figure I'll capture it. I just hold down shift to highlight these two. I'm going to control click. Uh, I'm going to say edit in Photoshop. What this is going to do is in a second it should bring up Photoshop for me. Come on. There we go. And now I have these two images in Photoshop. So I want to make sure in my window that I have timeline selected. See, it's down there. Turn that back on. All right, and so just pick one of your pictures. You're going to create a frame animation. Um, I'm going to go grab my other picture real quick. I'm just going to do Command A to select it, Command C to copy it, drop back in here and paste it in. Notice I've got two layers over here now. Um, I only have one frame in my timeline though. I'm going to add another frame. And I'm just going to make that top one invisible. So the other thing I'm going to do here is change from once to forever. That's how many times it loops. I'm going to highlight both of these and change these seconds of delay to 0.2. I'm going to hit play to look through it. And that's all there is to it. Now that I've got it, if I want to get it out, I am going to export, save for web. You'll probably want to jerry-rig some of this stuff and kind of get it to where it's not a gigantic size. In my case, um, this is a really big picture, um, and that's not going to work for me. So I'm just going to crank some of this stuff down, um, make a couple decisions here. Now it's down to one megabyte. Um, I could go smaller, but just as an example, I'll hit save. Save it here just to show you once again. Ignore that. I don't know why it says it. And here's the one I just made. Ticking away.